must be right. Everything's gone to plan. Who's this? This is the one you're supposed to let run off and live? Well, who did we just let go then? How's the money situation? He's injured, he's on foot. We'll get him back. Don't shoot! We know this base is empty! Well, the movie's really about honour and why that's important and why you should do something because you love it as opposed to being in it for money. And there's a couple of reasons for that. Uh, the film is the first movie about Gurkha soldiers that's ever been made. And these guys are the most honourable soldiers on the planet to a, to a large degree. And so I knew making a movie about them, we had to get that right. We had to get their cultural ideas about honour correct. And at the same time, for me as a writer-director, you know, I'm in this strange place as a career, you know, where I've made all these indie movies and I have this very loyal crew of people that have been with me on everything I started getting these Hollywood offers to hey come and direct this and but only you like we don't want the crew just you and so I was in this place where I was like well do I go and chase the money or do I stay loyal to my team and uh, well we made 400 bullets so that's I proved I stayed with my team and stayed loyal and a lot of that went into the movie so in, this, in a strange way the movie's sort of personal as well rounds we've got. I think there are a lot of silver linings to the pandemic in terms of independent cinema. In a strange way, there's never been a bigger demand for streaming stuff. It's also shown the industry that we don't necessarily need big CGI cities falling down to have to enjoy what we're, we're watching. And a lot of these smaller movies, you know, they're about character and they're about even like uh, Psycho Gorman that just came out. They, these films have found a footing that they might not have found otherwise. You know, hopefully it sends a strong message to Hollywood that, that actually they should be investing more in like the three four million pound films and taking some risks with you know some filmmakers like me and saying okay we'll go and make a crazy you know 400 bullets action film and let's see what we get you're crazy you go because you know that right yeah we know.